Good morning. This is Katie Green with the Divine Reading. Today is Monday. The first card I pull is the Ten of Wands, and it says, When you see this card, remember to say no to any new demands or projects. Review your to-do list and delegate what you can. Making yourself responsible for everyone's action is a recipe for dropping the ball somewhere. Give some of those tasks back. It's not all up to you. Clarity of belief. Blend into the environment. You have many skills and can fit into any situation. Take time to Access what is going on around you and adapt accordingly. Will of Fortune. Opportunity is knocking. Answer the door. How far are you willing to stretch for your desire? Comfort zones aren't the ideal spot right now. Are you up and ready? This wheel turns continually. Sometimes you are up. Sometimes you are down. Be ready to grab your chance at success. Share the love. Disengage from outcomes. Let go so you can open yourself to the highest love that you deserve. Find ways to release worry and any unresolved lack of forgiveness you might be holding on to. Queen of Cups. Let your response be informed by compassion. Deep dives into your emotional depths or your strength. Your ability to offer a sympathetic ear benefits yourself as well as others. Pour out your troubles as if you were talking to your best friend. The wise monarch used self-care as sacred. Take the lead. Dancing in the rainbow. Break free from whatever you feel is holding you back. Express happiness. Find out what you truly desire. The Chariot. Who's driving your life? Make sure you are the one making the decisions. This is about you and your choices. This is not the time to rely on others. Life can pull you in more than one direction. Now is the time to get back on track. Where are you heading? Plan your course. Choosing your battles. Convey your meaning. Reflect on the way you communicate with others and with yourself. Be sure to express thoughts and feelings from your heart and with respect and sincerity. Watchers, transpersonal. When watchers appear, it is an invitation to stop doing. Pause, get off the treadmill, and take a deep breath. Find the witness within, the one who can observe the fire and fuel happening around you, but is not caught in any other drama. The time is right to step back. If you have thought, or opinion, keep it to yourself. If you are having a feeling that needs to be expressed, do it in the shower. Do not engage with an action happening around you. Simply observe. Watchers show up to direct your attention to the horizon and away from the ant hill in front of you. Others might think you are simply doing nothing, but let them know that you are helping 
the sun to set in the evening sky. There are bigger things to attend to. You have spent such a long time trying to correct the course of events and the actions of others. Let it be for a short while. You become the observer rather than the doer. The watchers invite you to break free from linear, casual pace of petty due to day to day. To day. Rise to divine coincidence to seren serenity and notice how the act of seeing the heart of the matter produces results. Things happen without you doing anything. Creation unfolds in its own mysterious way, requiring only sacred witness. Proper Barrier for Freedom There is nothing to be gained and everything to be lost by trying to hold on to that which no longer serves us. Osiris, Lord of the Dead, guides you to now to release that which no longer needs to be a part of your life so that you may be free. And that is your ring for today. I am love. We are love. Thank you for watching.